Okay, welcome back. So yeah, uh, we got our enhanced AR, so we have two people with them, so that feels really good. Well, three if, we, if someone goes down, actually. So uh, I think they can use whatever weapon, though, but that's pretty cool still. Um, so yeah, we got a repel point, keypad door, security door, two uh, encounters, and androids are present. But we have patchwork for that. Uh, so yeah, no, this is pretty good. This is pretty good. Oh yeah, and we have to remember that terminal is the one with our dodge. I wasn't really using her as a tank last time. Not that we should, anyway. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's let's go. I'm excited about Axiom too. He's training for uh, armor and mobility. Anyway, let's give it a go with our new assault rifles. Yes, 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 yes. Friendly VIP is definitely here. Okay, so all units through this entrance get plus 50, uh, plus 50 dodge, plus 3 mobility, stun, but just on the breach itself. All units through this entrance get plus 50 dodge. So we've got two people who can dodge, one who can be mo mobile. Mobile should, oh, I was going to say our shotgunner, but we don't have our shotgunner. Um, maybe blue blood, since... Uh, he wants to end on a movement ability anyway. So yeah, let's do him with the repel point. Oh shoot, that means we can't use our scan though. And dodge on... Terminal already has dodge, so we could stack her up so she's like immune for the first round almost. That sounds good. Uh, and... Surprise... Stun... I'm hoping we'll finish with him, so let's give Patchwork the stun, um, and then he can have dodge. So yeah, uh, he'll be in the back to clean up, is that right? Um, let's see, uh, I'm just trying to think. We want you first so you can pack a unit, uh, a robotic unit. Uh, probably you last, since you don't do a whole lot. I just didn't say that, he, he, does, he does work. Um, Probably you last as well. Maybe you second here so you can um, knock people down and stuff like that, stupor people. Um, means you can't really knock someone out in the breach though. And yeah, let's go you and then you. I think that's fine. I think that's fine. But yeah, unfortunately we can't uh, use our gremlins here. Alright, uh, but yeah, let's go. So we just have to remember order. You really should show turn order. Okay, so yeah, this looks pretty good. We'll send them through in this order. Like I said, her first so she can stun uh, or take over units. And then he, yep, yep, looks good. Alright, so. Basically, we just keep in mind that Verge is first. Oh, her stats will stun. That's that's unfortunate uh, because I was gonna have him take the same shots at, as at her. So the stun, either the stun is gonna be wasted or the trank rounds are gonna be race, wasted. But it is what it is. So yeah, basically, we have to keep in mind trank rounds second, stun shots. Oh. Yeah, she'll stun. We could, of course, move that around then. Maybe we, maybe we switch the points up, still leave her in first, though. Uh, I kind of like the idea of getting her dodge. Maybe he... No, I didn't want him to stun, so we'd have to swap her. Maybe her shot stun. Yeah, maybe let's do something like that. Let's swap these two. So terminal shots will stun. She'll go through first. Something like this. So terminal will come through with, or sorry, patchwork will come through uh, with dodge. Uh, Verge will come through with trank rounds. Then terminal will come through with stun. It's too bad. I wanted to give terminal the dodge, uh, but we had we had these these people needed the, to be in the ones that did not have stun for it to make best use of stun. Back again. Welcome back. I'm theory crafting here, sort of thing. Oh, but yeah, I think this is fine. So we've got uh, Trank and then Stun at the end. 
Trank second stun at the end. Let's go. Ready to go. Breach! 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 Oh! Your little legs. Alright. We could shoot pretty good shot at the bruiser. We could take pretty good shot at the purifier. Turret is surprised, I don't really care. An alert trooper. We'd actually have a chance to kill there. An alert android, don't really care. An alert guardian. 64 though, we can't hit this guy unfortunately. Uh, I'm not super scared about the bruiser. Um, we could pile it on the purifier or the bruiser I think is what we want. Uh, Verge will take another shot and get a knockdown in theory after this. Um, I wish we could hit the Guardian. Uh, but yeah, I'm thinking Purifier or Bruiser. Don't really care about the turret. We'll hack that. Trooper is nasty, but we don't have quite as good a chance of shooting uh, him. So yeah, I think... Surprise Bruiser and Surprise Purifier. Um, let's do the Purifier. Purifiers can be nasty. Four damage. All right, Verge, you want to clean that up for me? Um, did you did you hair trigger in breach? You fucking no! It just it didn't swap. I thought I didn't know that could happen, but yeah, no. You can see since we have levitate, this is now. Yeah, it was just glitching out. It was Verge. That would have been so cool. I wanted to take two shots. <laughs> 100% on purifier. No, it's the bug you said yesterday. Alright. Alright. Uh, but yeah, let's take out the purifier here with sleepy rounds. You don't do anything special. We could get a bunch of damage on the android. Ooh, there's a mech back there. We probably want to do damage to the mech, get it in kill range. Or trooper. Trooper. I, I wish I knew which order they were going to be moving in. Trooper is decent because then we could get it in, in knockout range. Do we want to leave the mech up though? No, I think we take the decent shot here. Hope to roll high. But actually, it doesn't matter, and then we kill it with the zap. That's good. Oh! Unless we graze on the 85. Alright, we've got a stun here. Uh, we could stun the android. We could stun the trooper. Ooh, we could try to stun the guardian, but we don't have high shots. I think we stun the trooper here. Nice. Hunt her down, hunt her down. Shield, I fucking hate guardians. Ooh, that's actually kind of tricky. Alright, patchwork. Let's do it. You are going to start off with reprogram probably the turret turret has more armor hard to deal with android now has a shield which makes him kind of hard to deal with too though they got somewhat equal chances slightly higher on the android we could use the android as like an explosive too um so i'm actually tempted to use the android the turret is kind of annoying because it can mark though and like i said has more damage um kind of torn here actually Android is moving first as well. Um, I think, yeah, I think we'll hack the android here. Get, yeah, get the shield. Yeah, I think so. I wonder if it stays on. It looks like it. Yeah. Um, and then we chaining jolt. Oh, we could. Oh, yeah, we can kill the turret. We could also get damage. Oh, shit. We can't see the mech with you. That's too bad. But yeah, I think we just kill the turret. Where is the turret? Down here? Yeah, let's kill the turret. We could also kill the trooper. Guardian is going to move, but I already used its shield, so that's not super worry worrying. Yeah, let's just chaining jolt the turret. Blowing some fuse. She's so good. Don't knock precision. Against robotic enemies, at least. But yeah, she's so good. Like all the agents are kind of OP. Um, we could crimes. What is that noise? Yikes. Oh, I guess it was a bug. Something was roaring. That was weird. Um, I wish the uh, androids could subdue. That would be great. 
Oh, we could just go... St what's the... It is pretty big, so we could stand here and prime self-destruct. And if they shoot at us, we get something. I think so. Like, I'm fine with just using this guy as a target practice. So yeah, let's move you over here. Prime self-destruct. He probably won't die in one turn anyway. I probably should have used shots first. Like, I don't think they can kill him anyway. Oh! Okay, Verge. We got Mind Play with him, which I'm excited about. Let's battle. Uh, we could battle the Bruiser. Do we have a stupor for someone either? No. Let's battle Madness the Bruiser then. No, no, no! And I believe what? Engaging we've, knocked, target. we've knocked down one person now, is that correct? Uh, did we? Oh yeah, and we have to remember there's the collectible thing. Collect the evidence. Uh, that's going to be Blue Blood. He's pretty fast. We could take a 100% shot on the mech. Uh, a 6 to 7 ignores armor. So it's in kill range potentially for patchwork again, but it's a bit of a... Let's see, Mind Play, how much damage does it do? It's not showing. Maybe three here, since it's highlighting, and still highlighting three? I don't know. Is your health still highlighted? What is this game? I'm enjoying it, but come on, this is, get, this is getting ridiculous. I'd love to get another person in the neural net, but... No. We could neural net someone else. I'm not even sure it's necessary though. Um, I think we just take a shot. We got a crit chance here. Um, maybe, yeah, let's just try to get the guardian down. I think that's pretty good. Ooh, we crit. Blue Blood alone cleaned up. Nice. We did, however, get cooperation, which is pretty fucking sweet. Shoot, you don't really have good shots here, though. First turn? That's nuts. On, on impossible, still, I'm assuming. Ooh, we could even damage our own mech if we, or our android, if we want. Uh, Guardian, shoot, Guardian is three. I want that guy alive if possible, and this would kill. Classic. Classic? What do you mean? I don't, I don't even remember that being a option. Expert. All right, that's. Still pretty damn nuts. Alright, um, it is unfortunate the Guardian... Oh, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Yeah, I wish they wouldn't change the difficulty names. Oh, I guess we could grenade... No, because that kills two. This is annoying, because I want people alive. We just don't really have good shots. I want to, I kind of want to cooperate Verge so he can t knock out the Guardian again. Why can't we see the bruiser? The bruiser is glitched out or something. Yeah, that's. I guess that's the problem. Can we pin someone down. Wait, did we have another pin down? Oh, we can pin down our own android. Trooper needs to be dealt with, actually. Maybe we do just kill the trooper? We didn't have a great shot on the trooper. We could kill the guard. No, because I don't think you. You have such good aim. Maybe you can still shoot there, though. This is kind of tricky. I think I do want to cooperate. Um, you and then maybe I, I'm not a huge fan of killing the guardian like this, but it might be the play. We could even grenade. Oh, except we can't see the bruiser anyway. I guess we could grenade 
to kill the Guardian and then overwatch the Bruiser or something. If we want to be very efficient. There's also the mech in the back we can't see. Guardian is moving last. So yeah, this just feels bad, but we don't have other good uses. We could of course run down. Oh shit, I forgot about the thing there. So yeah, maybe we actually, oh no, Blue Blood I think can get that. Um, I think he's faster. Where are you anyway? Right here, right next to her. Hopefully he can get there. He should be able to. So yeah, this just all feels very weird. I think we, I think we do cooperate Verge though. Cooperation is pretty nuts. Um, and then Verge. Oh, you can see the Bruiser and the Mech. We could kill the shield guy with the grenade. Yeah, yeah, I think that's the play. I think that's the play. Uh, we can do this in either order, right? Yes. Pretty cool. Um, I think we don't damage the android just, just because we don't really need to make it explode yet. Um, the more shots it absorbs, the better anyway. Yeah, let's do this, kill the Guardian, drop the shields, get the awesome Bruiser plan. in range uh, to knock out, hopefully. What? Why didn't that kill? Why didn't that kill? That's what I want to know. That's really what I want to know. It's so weird. That's so weird. Armor? Ah, must have missed that. All right. Damn, so yeah, we can't do that. That's too bad. Ah, oh, that's super upsetting. I wish that had killed the Guardian. Oh, we could still kill the Guardian, but now this has too much health. We should have... No, we couldn't, we couldn't order it that way. Um, and you still can't see the fucking Bruiser. Annoying bug. Man, it's annoying we can't kill the Bruiser either. Bruiser is moving next. That's really too bad. I wish that had gone a little differently. We could, of course, just stupor the Bruiser, but I don't think I'm too concerned about it. Let's just take this guy out for the knockout. We could even teamwork someone, but I don't want to use everyone. Can you teamwork yourself? I just want to see now. We can! We could teamwork Verge. That's hilarious. Give him two more actions. I think I'll save it for the for the next room though. That's amazing though. You can cooperation into uh, into teamwork. <laughs> uh, nutty. Alright. Oh and shoot, we haven't neural netted this guy either, unfortunately. But I think this is our best move, just take this guy out, even though he moves so far down the line. Actually, you know what? I wonder, is it just better to get damage on this guy? No, because he might blow up the android. Probably not, though. Um, ugh. Choices. I'm really not happy about this. This guy's way too far down the line. We can, like, knock him out with... He, actually, yeah, I think she could get far enough? I don't remember. She's still got an action, too, so we could just move down... Damage and Overwatch. Damage and Overwatch. Should kill him. Oh. Oh, you're right, because she has Overwatch. Oh, we could even... Does the Overwatch order matter? Oh, no, because... Ah. I'm torn. So you're saying damage with this guy and then Overwatch. We could also do it the other way, too. We could overwatch here first. I'm not sure the order matters, but if he steps out... It's not even guaranteed he steps out. Um, yeah, I'm actually kind of tempted we could overwatch here and hope this guy runs into her first. I don't think it works that way, though, because he has vision on her, so he would fire first, so yeah. We could try that. What does that get us, though? I guess just less actions from him. He might fire on the mech anyway, though. We could also just stupor him. Oh! That guy is in the neural net. 64 to crit. 64 to 
crit. Six. We still don't have it though. We'd have to roll high and crit and he's still left with one health. Um, but yeah, we could try overwatching, but there's no guarantee what he does. I think I just knock out this guy. It feels bad, but I think I just take that now. Um, actually, can we overwatch just the trooper? We could overwatch something like that and hope the trooper moves. And that's not bad. Double overwatch here, maybe? Double overwatch, hope the bruiser doesn't trigger it, and we knock out the trooper, because that's a better use of our little free action here, is a knockout on the trooper. Um, is that troll? I don't know. Could even do something like that, so if he does move forward, we get damage on him. But if he doesn't, we don't. Or we... Let's see, what's her overwatch? Because, yeah, maybe we overwatch... Her here, he'd have to come up here. I don't think he does anyway, but yeah, that lets us knock out the trooper, which is a bigger threat anyway. So I actually think I like something like this. Yeah, let's try it. I have no clue if this will work, but they're not huge threats anyway. Uh, do we want to kill the trooper? So yeah, as it is, we're setting it up where if this guy moves forward, she should get the shot first. He'll enter the things first. I don't think I want to hit the trooper. Wait, this guy's probably going to trigger overwatch anyway, so maybe we do, and then we'll kill either the trooper. I don't think I care about killing the trooper though, so maybe we just overwatch here. Trooper is actually kind of nasty. I don't care if we get the kill on him. Um, so yeah, let's do this. Hopefully, hopefully the bruiser triggers her overwatch first. Watch you miss all the Overwatch. True, that is of course a possibility because this is XCOM. We are counting. Riot Guard. I haven't seen that ability before. I, I knew it. He's just gonna shoot the. So yeah, he yep he didn't do anything. But oh yes, she missed. She did actually miss. She grazed there. So yeah, we did get the knockout. So I think that's two. I'm so bad at keeping track, and I can't wait until there's a mod for it. Um. I wish I knew what Riot Guard does. I also wish you could see why can't, I guess these are blocking line of sight or something. It's kind of screwy. But yeah, ideally I want to end on a move. Who's going next? Scary Mech. Then the Guardian. But I want to end on a move to make use of his uh, thing. Oh, we could subdue the Guardian. Is there cover? And we're near the mech. We're near our own explosion. So that's we kind of played ourselves there. Um, but yeah, we could subdue this guy, and then get enter Overwatch. But that doesn't really get us much. And we want to be close to this. Uh, mech Guardian is Guardian. We'll be able to deal with. Maybe Patchwork can knock her out. No, Patchwork's too far away. We're gonna have to kill the Guardian anyway. I think. Um, but yeah, maybe here to avoid planks from the mech. Maybe we go here, which will get us there next turn, uh, which is fine. Go here, take shots at the bruiser. We could grenade too. They like to shoot explosive covers. Ah, uh, yeah. That's not explosive though, is it? Speaking of covers, I don't think so, because we can't target it. Um, Okay, yeah, go here, shoot the bruiser. We could even grenade, not a question. Oh, I see what you're saying, yeah. No, they do seem to like it. Um, let's let's go here. Okay, yeah, this is subpar. I wish we could end with the overwatch, but we can't really. Um we could grenade and move. Oh shit, we could... That's actually interesting. That's something we could do. Grenade as a free action. Blow up our own android. Kill the guardian. And... I know, I don't want to be that close though. We, can, we still have a turn, so I want to get somewhat close. And... Uh, 
But yeah, and then we'd be skipping our action anyway, so it all it all evens out. Like we dash, yes, we'd trigger ever vigilant, but we wouldn't get another action in there, so it's all the same. Um, but yeah, I'm kind of tempted to blow these guys up, and then we can dash here. Hopefully, wow, he's got crit chance on that too. I think this is pretty good. Um, four to five. Actually, it might do too much. It might kill. This guy's got seven. We hit... Yeah, I think that does too much. I think that definitely kills. Unfortunate. Just just so you know, the game doesn't have XCOM 2 bug where free actions remove Ever Vigilant. Um, true, but I don't care. I still want to... So yeah, we could do something like this, four, ah, we'd need five or roll high on the thing. Um, oh, and that's the same issue though, is we're, we'd get blown up by our own mech. So yeah, unfortunately, if we blow up the mech, we could do something like that, but I don't know how much damage the mech does, Can I, or I keep calling it mech, android. I wish we could see... Yeah, I don't think it does 5 damage. It might do like 3 to 4 damage. So, and if it did 4, we'd still have to roll high on the knockout. Oh, and it, it, oh, he's got armor. He's got armor. I wasn't, I, I did it again. I wasn't taking that into account. Um, Blue Blood, let me select you. So, maybe we do this. Shoot, it blows up our cover, though. I just realized. Blows up our cover. Oh. But yeah, it's unfortunate. Our mech is blowing things up. Android. Um, yeah, even that still gets hit. Okay, yeah, we could blow this up. Shred armor. One or two, I'm not sure. You can see the radius. Oh yeah, if we could target. Oh, we can see on the subdue. Oh, we can't subdue the android. I can't see the radius because because I don't have shots on him. I think is the issue. Um, all right, mech is moving. We have patchwork. Can't get down there. Yeah, no line of sight. Um, android. I wish android moved before mech. We could teamwork our android. No, I'm just kidding. Um, this isn't bad, but it does leave us out in the open and take one kill from us. Uh, I think we might just move down here and take a normal shot. It's not It's not super impressive, but it might still be our best move. I need a better I think angle. So. I think I'm overthinking it. Like it would have been cool if we could get something fancy in there, but it was not to be. Okay, and yeah, I don't want to kill this dude, so... So yeah, unfortunately, no Ever Vigilant. You know what? Maybe we grenade anyway. Maybe we do something like this. Grenade to shred armor and do damage and then shoot. Other thing, of course, is we could actually shred the mech. We can't really see, but yeah, let's... Let's, uh... That's, that's funny. Check now. I still don't think I can see the... Oh, yeah, we actually have to go into it. Yeah. Oh, so that is safe. Okay. Okay. So we could grenade and then go to right here. We'd still be out in the open, but... So yeah, interesting. So it's actually a... Not a square. It's a circle. So it's your square and then three tiles on each side there. So yeah, we could stand right there for safety. Should we do that? We could throw this here. Then hopefully knock out here. Only problem is we're standing out in the open. And we, we should still be in range to get it next time. I think I do this just for the cool factor. Let's go ahead. Friendly, yes, but it's our android. We don't care. It does kill the guardian, but that's fine. Alright, let's do it, just for fun. Oh, he's got three health! He's got three health. I'm still gonna do it. 
Yes! Oh, love it when a plan comes together. And we get Overwatch. Oh, Blue Blood, you beast. What? He didn't do anything. All right. Uh, we can Chaining Jolt here. That was a nice. Let's move forward and Chaining Jolt for the kill. Okay. Okay. And so we captured one more. Um, so that's three now? He got stunned from Breach. Oh, the mech did? Oh yeah, we, I guess we stunned the mech. So bad at keeping track of things. Yeah, let's just knock this dude out. Overloading target. wonder if we even need to collect the evidence anymore. Might just auto-collect. Yep, collect the evidence. Cool. That was quite the turn. I like that. Took a little while to figure out, but we got there. Uh, do -do 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 -do. All right, we have a keypad door. Successful shots on enemies will crit. That's pretty nice. And we have a security door. There are fewer aggressive enemies. First unit through this entrance is marked. I think we just ignore this. Put everyone through the keypad door. Uh, we don't have anyone who benefits from going first. I don't really care about blue blood first. Verge maybe last to clean up, or actually probably not. Let's put one person through first, if not patchwork. Maybe terminal through first. No, let's just put blue blood through first. Um, who wants critic? You get critic. You get critic. Everyone gets critic. Yep. And see verge next no because we might not have enough damage let's put patchwork through speaking of crit she'll crit everyone too and then verge then terminal something like that yeah that looks pretty good and since i like to explain things i want him through first just because he's not super useful and i want i didn't want her through first but i want her through early so she's just he's kind of opening the door for for her so she can use her scanner as well as be early in the turn order for uh, knocking out enemy uh, robotics and then we've got him to clean up and then her at the end in case we need heals or whatever uh, so yeah seems like a pretty decent turn order let's go Don't punch up. so yeah I think we've captured three so we want two more subdues if possible We'll probably go for three just to be on the safe side if they're available. All right, we have an aggressive turret, so someone's getting shot. We've got a surprised android. We've got a aggressive Andromedon. Okay, hi, new guy. Hi, new guy. Hi. Uh, we have a alert android and a alert purifier. All right, purifier is a decent target. Andromedon. Oh, we've got decent shots on the Andromedon. Uh, three to four. Yeah, you just got your first one too. Cool, 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 cool. All right, and second. Nice. But yeah, let's uh, let's pour fire into the new guy here. I wish we had some way to shred first, but we don't. So, and third. Wait, we missed a ninety-four. You piece of shit. All right. Um. Okay, critical. That's more like it. Verge? Is there anyone you can knock out? I don't think so. Wow, almost. Oh, wow. If we high rolled, we could crit and take out the purifier, but I don't. 94 is the new 97, really. I don't think it's worth the gamble. I think we just uh, smack the Andromedon. So, no, it's not wasted. Oh, yeah, because there's armor too. Oh, we have to high roll on this too, actually, which we did. Good job. Uh, Android turret. Android purifier. Weird. There's. I guess there's not a second stage of the Andromedon. Or maybe. I, mean, I guess time's still frozen, so maybe we can't target the second stage. We'll see. We'll see. I'm expecting it behaves similarly. All right, there is. Yeah, I figured. But oh, and we've got a crit, so we've got decent chance to kill here. Oh, we've got decent chance if we roll high. Anyone else aggressive turret will probably hack the turret. Although, like I said, hacking androids is actually kind of useful too, since you can turn them into bombs. Um, so yeah, we've got 
alert, alert, surprised, aggressive. This is our last guy though, so it doesn't, we can't take out the aggressive. Um, so yeah, no point for, actually there's some point pouring damage on. Who do we want to take out next? Maybe, maybe we just try to get some damage on the purifier. Hey, good job. Oof. All right. So we nailed the purifier, which is going to be nice. Oh. I see the VIP. You are go for rescue. That was yeah, that was pretty decent aside from us getting smacked. And yeah, there is a second stage. Um who goes first? Blue blood. What can you do? We could hit the Andromedon shell, but they're actually moving last, so not the not the priority. We could shoot at some of these androids here. Sadly, Patchwork doesn't get to go first. We could we could teamwork Patchwork for a hack on an android or something, though. Android or turret. That turret's not bad. They've got so much armor. Yeah, maybe we teamwork Patchwork up to deal with the turret. How many humans do we have here? One, well, uh, humanoids, I should say. Two, it looks like. So yeah, we want to capture both these guys. That actually makes our choices a little tricky, too. Um, let's... Go. Wait, one, two... Oh, that's an android. Alright, yeah, I guess there are just two. A lot of androids. A lot of androids. Oh yeah, because we got the dark event, for one thing. Can we end on a subdue? Wait. Oh, oh yeah, you can subdue anyone. Uh, let's see. I think we destroy one of the androids and then teamwork for the other. Let's see. So yeah, we could shoot one of these androids. 57, 88. So yeah, I think we shoot this android twice. Nice. And yeah, let's go ahead, teamwork, patchwork. And finish off the android. Pretty decent. And patchwork. Oh, we don't have reprogram, but we do have chaining jolt. Uh, turret. Oh, Guardian's gonna do their thing. That's annoying. Wow, that's actually a lot of damage. Um, Guardian is gonna do their thing. I, damn, purify. Oh, we could kill that android. This one's moving. Actually, this one's moving as well and further away. Maybe we just kill this one. It's a little annoying. Not exactly how I wanted things to go. We can blow something up. Not good. Yeah, I guess we just chaining jolt this. Do we want to move? Is there full cover around? Not really. Yeah, I think we're in decent cover here. I wish we could, like, turret is still going to move. Yeah, I mean, uh, I guess we leave the androids up. I think we shock the turret. Because Verge can't one-shot the turret anyway. Um... So yeah, I mean, we want to take out the turret, and we've only got one more move before then, so I think we have to shock the turret. I wish we had reprogrammed. Does stasis, stasis only take... Oh! Stasis only takes one action. So if we want it, I think it does have a cooldown. Yeah, two turn cooldown. We... Oh! Can we stasis the guardian? Make the guardian skip a turn. Yes, we can. That is worse. Let's Freezing think... We'll, we'll have... We'll make sure there's less, less around for him to shield when he comes out of uh, stasis. That's pretty good. And then we will go ahead and shock the turret. I'm pretty happy with that. Pretty happy Melting with that. Melting hardware. Illuminating. Any time now. There we go. Only problem is we're ignoring the Andromedon shell. Oh, wait, what? Wait, what? Okay, we spawned next to uh, explosives. That's good to know. That was weird. It, it, the animations are get. Holy shit! 
I didn't even see that though, that's unfortunate. Uh, the animations are getting really screwy, so I didn't even see exactly what happened. Um, that's unfortunate. Uh, we don't have a medkit on them. You're on fire. You're... Verge gets their turn, then this purifier. We can't go for the stun. Can we... We, we do have a decent shot on there, especially if we put someone in the neural net. Uh, you would have to stay out in the open, though, for that. Ah, oh, this sucks. I want to take that out. Shit! And then Dramadon gets a turn. You get a heal, though. I guess you heal yourself. Verge is not on fire, thankfully. I'd say, I think we stay out in the open. Can we battle madness someone? We could battle madness you and hope you shoot this guy. But it might not be worth it since um, since you might also move. Sometimes they move when you berserk them. Yes, I do. That's a good point. Uh, I don't have anyone in the link yet, though. But yeah, we could actually mind play. But yeah, let's uh, stupor the... Your mind that is a good point, though, since I think it's 100% or something. Oh, or we could, like I was about to say, or we could just stun too, and then we don't even care about that guy for now. Um, we don't want to mind play. We could 100% the Andromedon, 6. Even if we crit, it's still alive, though. Mind play. I, I don't know. Um, we could move now, or we have a decent chance to kill that guy. Maybe that's what we do. That would kill the guy. We don't want to do that. There's a guardian back there, but they are a stasis anyway. I think, or no, the stasis will end by then. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and take this guy out of rotation, I think. I think that's our best use of our action point here. Or we can miss another 80 something? Jesus. Come Wait. Oh, she burned out on her turn. That sucks. That's good, though, that he missed. I thought we'd be able to uh, fix ourselves before then. That's too bad. Terminal, down again. That really sucked. I don't think she even got a turn on Breach. I think it was the exact same thing that happened to her last time. She got 100 to 0 before she even got to move. All right, we got blue blood here now. Let's see what we can got. And I can't believe all these shots were missing. So this guy was was stunned, but is now better. Uh, patchwork, I think we'll still not have the ability. This guy's gonna get to move. Now the not again makes sense. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, can we stay? We can stabilize. No, you're running. Oh yeah, you don't have a gremlin. Oh. Sh she can't stay gremlin, gremlin stabilize either. Maybe we wait and hope Verge is still alive to grem, to normal stabilize since he's right next to her. Uh, Blue blood, what can you do? What can you do here? This is pissing me off. And just so we know, there's the other explosive over there that we know about. Um, we could flank the android. Oh no, we we probably want shots first. This guy's moving next. Purifier's still way off. This guy we can't really deal with. I think we try to shoot this guy twice. 73, 63, 4 to 6. With not much crit chance. Uh, 3 to 4. We'd have to roll high. Let's go ahead. Is that what we want to do? Is that our best bet? I think so. Of course, we could just kill the Andromedon shell right now. Um, but Andromedon shell's still way back. I want to stop these guys from. Hey! Oh shit, you rolled low though. I think we dead eye for safety here. Because if you roll low, you lose. Here, we're guaranteed to kill if we hit. Hey, good job. Okay. Alright, and. Oh, did you hair trigger? I guess you hair triggered, huh?
Okay, you could now stabilize, but you'd run through poison. Um, oh, you know what we can do? We can subdue, and that puts us into overwatch as well. See, so yeah, I think that gives us more damage overall. Gives us overwatch on the android. Oh, I think we kill the android. No, because that'll bounce chain to this guy, which is unfortunate. We can't actually zap this guy. We might have reprogram available. Um, or we just leave him up. Um, but yeah, I think we subdue the Andromedon and end in Overwatch. You do have one action, right? Yeah, that will end turn. So yeah, let's subdue, then get Overwatch. So just get a little bit extra damage. I love his little uh, Ever Vigilant. That was pretty nice. Alright. Stasis ended on this guy. Okay. What can you do? You can chaining Joel. Yeah, unfortunately it would kill that guy, and I think we want to take that guy. We might just have to do this anyway. Uh, we're in that desperate spot where we might just be like, yeah, whatever, and hope we still get intel. It's not the end of the world if we don't anyway. Uh, yeah, we might just want to kill. We probably do want to kill because Verge is in range where... I don't think he goes down, but it would... It would wound him, and we don't want everyone out with wounds at the same time. So yeah, I think we do Chaining Jolt kill both those guys, unfortunately. I think that's our best play. We could now stabilize... Oh, you Oh, you can Gremlin stabilize. I don't know if it's a free action or not, but yeah, maybe we Gremlin stabilize with you. That lets us stupor this guy, add him to the network, and then take actions with Verge. Uh, yeah, I don't like that you're out in the open, and I don't like that you're sitting on an Andromedon, but that still might be our best bet. Let's Verge has two actions. So yeah, let's go ahead, Gremlin stabilize here. I can't believe that happened. That was, uh, not great. Um, we could take shots at the shell, but that's not a priority. I think we just zap the android. Don't let him move. And Guardian is going to move, but I'm not Nine super seconds. concerned about that. Whittle him down. Ah, oh, shoot! It does make Verge. Ah, ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, Gremlin, stop glitching out. Um, but yeah, it does make Verge less accurate. I realized. All right, because it kills someone in his neural net. Oh my God! Okay, so Verge gets wounded anyway. That's kind of unfortunate. And. Actually, Andromedon is next, so... Uh, can we kill Andromedon? We absolutely can, if we roll high. Uh, so let's get more crit chance. Uh, let's get more crit chance and accuracy here, and possibly stun this dude. Your thoughts are mine. Your thoughts are mine. Verge has got to be my favorite. Oh, nice, we did hit the stun too. Yeah, Verge is just beasting it and yeah then let's try to kill this guy hope this works hey we knocked him unconscious I'm too interesting interesting and now it's blue blood's turn huh Uh, we could just fire twice at this guy. Uh, he's stunned as well. We can't really get flanks. Uh, let's go ahead and take 57. He missed. Why can't... What, what is going on? Oh, I guess... Are you out of ammo? Your thing is not displaying, my dude. Are you out of ammo? Are you out of ammo? God damn, this whole thing sucks. Ah, they really need to fix their UI. Like, the UI is bad anyway, and then it randomly disappears too. Like, it's the most frustrating thing. I, I'm guessing he's out of ammo, but I don't know. <laughs> Good to go. Good to go. Good job. A little too late there. Uh. We could chaining jolt. He's still stunned. Let's move forward and chaining jolt. 
Going to move. Watch your step. Jolting the target. And he's Zapping the target. still stunned, I believe. Electrify. Stasis. I think he's still stunned. Yeah. Stop it. And now we've got audio bugs and shit too. Uh, how much damage does this do? It does not say. I think three. It's so bugged. It's so fucking bugged. And I hate it. Uh, let's move up close to this guy. This is a little risky, but we've got everyone else's turn anyway. So yeah, let's just move up Crossing closer over. and hopefully, uh... Ah! Anyway, let's go ahead and do that. Nice! We hit. Whew! This was a, uh, bad one. Hopefully we can get out without too much... Uh, additional nonsense. Wait a sec, it's still not showing his shit. I'll keep an eye out. Smart thing. Yeah, we just lost the uh, UI entirely. Uh, we'll move up. Can anyone cover me? Oh, we're just out of range. That's too bad. Alright, let's just go ahead and overwatch. I mean, it would show if uh, reinforcements will happen. Yeah, it happens sometimes. It really shouldn't, though. Is that too much to ask? Let's move Moving forward. Quickly. Shoot, Stay maybe I should have stayed a little closer to, to get the heal. That is what it is. Alright, let's do it. Do we win, or do we have to leave? Even, of course we do. Um, where are we going to? Wow, all the way over there. That's rough. That's rough, man. That is rough, man. Um, oh, it, it's Snake Guy's turn, huh? Uh, enemies won't get a move first, so... Maybe we just put you, like, as far away from them as possible. I wish we could go right there, but Patchwork's in the way. So yeah, maybe we just go here. They won't get shots yet. So yeah, let's do that. Slither, my friend. VIP will have another turn. Oh yeah, huh, I forgot about that. Alright, and Blue Blood, you're gonna run back and then you get Overwatch automatically, which is nice. Feel the fire Overwatch, coming. ever vigilant. And Patchwork. Jump the gun. I wish I could get the heal on Verge, but I kind of screwed up ordering. I think we just pull you back as far as possible. Overwatch somewhere. Overwatch this door, this door, uh, I guess this door since we already overwatched with someone there and I think Verge is more likely to overwatch that one. Uh, this doesn't cover it though if they go the wrong way. Um, whatever, I think I'll still try that. And Verge, I really wish we could get you healing. Uh, and shoot. Ah, you're not going to be able to use multiple actions here. And we'll overwatch. I will door. fire if they reposition. And cool, we, you did get another turn. Wow, you can almost get out. Uh, let's stick you here and hunker. Like I said, I don't think they get shots on him anyway. Her, but shit. You know what? Let's let's just move it. Get him far as far away as possible. Reinforcements. Game did not crash. Good. All right. Ooh, almost dead. Oh, nice work, patchwork. Nice work, patchwork. Um, we really have to be running, but it's very tempting to knock this guy. Uh, knock. Wait, are there only two guys left? There's only two guys left. In which case, I will. I will shoot this guy. I don't think I Deadeye, since it could technically kill. So yeah, we fire our normal weapon. This is in regular range, yes. Alright, this is why I love Blue Blood skills. We're gonna fire this guy. Do a bunch of damage. And... 
Oh, Trooper is actually also in auto range, um, but Bruiser acts first. So then we'll go subdue this guy, which arrest. gives us another Overwatch. And Verge is going to be the one doing this. I might... No, we probably still want Overwatch, right? Reload and Overwatch? I want to heal Verge at some point, but it just hasn't been working out. I guess maybe we bring Verge back here next turn and uh, take the shot. We're going to trank this guy. I think that's what we do. So yeah, let's just go ahead and reload. Actually, I guess we should... No, because I that's, that's the thing. I, I almost played myself, too. Again, uh, we don't want to be... She's in range anyway, but yeah, so we don't want to be retreating with her because we want Verge to be able to pl uh, play catch-up. Um, so yeah, we also have Chaining Jolt, but only target is someone we want to trank. So let's go ahead and reload here. Gonna reload. And then Overwatch again. That worked last time, so we'll do it again. <laughs> It'd be funny if someone spawns on the place we can't see, though. Um, and then let's bring you down here. You still have shots. Yeah, we want heals and we want to be close enough to evac, so unfortunately no stupor plus shot. But we have guaranteed trank here, which means I think we're up to, thanks to the reinforcements, I think we're up to guaranteed intel as well. Always fun. Let's get our VIP out. Reinforcements come in. Moving to position. Poor Verge. Verge got wrecked. Wow, they did actually spawn the place we don't see. That's really annoying. You're good. You're so awesome. You're also in a little bit of trouble here. Reinforcements are still coming. We could do the same thing. We could uh, dead eye this guy even. And then knock out this guy. There's three guys now. We do need to keep running with blue blood, but it's so fun knocking people around. Um, damn, I'd love to be able to do that. I guess we could still take a shot and move, but then we don't have the subdue ability. Um, I think we have subdued enough, so it doesn't really matter. We could take a shot and then move to here. That's not bad. Uh, I think we go for the kill versus the more damage. Like this would be more efficient on the damage. Yeah, I think we just kill this guy. Nice. And then move. Which gives us every vigilance. But yeah, uh, if they move, I'll shoot. Blue blood's pretty nuts. Thank you. Whoo! Missed verge. Excellent. At this point, it doesn't really matter though. Like if they hit verge, all it does is save us having to evac him. Honestly, um, let's go ahead and med I'll kit here. Heal. Yep, we're doing it. And we have a shock here, which does not kill. We have this, which has a chance to kill. We can evac. Um, Verge is Verge can also evac. So all we need is blue blood, but blue blood's not in the best position. So I don't think we evac this turn. Might be a little greedy. We could move back and shoot. I wish we could do it in any order, but we can't. We could move to here or even here if we're confident in. I think Verge will be able to take this guy out, but I don't know if we'll be able to see. Wow, we can see from all the way back here. So maybe we go here, shoot at this guy, then try to take this guy out with Verge. So yeah, this is flanked, but I think we'll be fine. That's weird that that's half cover, whatever. Yeah, let's do that. Oh, we can even still chaining jolt that guy if we want. That's only 65. We could also chaining jolt that guy. Uh, chaining jolt this guy. Bring the hostile. We could also don't stasis, but I don't think we need to. Oh, gremlins! You silly, silly things. 
It's amazing how buggy this game is. I'm still enjoying it overall, but yeah, holy shit. Let's see. And you don't have the hair trigger, right? I don't think we can even tell, but um, yeah, I think I gave this bug I'm not getting. Ah, uh, I hadn't got it. This was the first time too. There's always new and exciting bugs to get. Um, you could evac. It's not bad. Um, let's see, something popped up here on the laptop. Go away. There we go. Um, yeah, we could evac here, but I still want to give support to Blue Blood, and I'm hoping to take out this trooper. Uh, let's go here, and then we can choose. This guy's not as big of a threat since Blue Blood gets to move first. We got 80 on this guy with a decent crit chance. We have to roll high or crit. Uh, we could also just go for stupor, but I think we try. Oh! oh what low. a beast. Alright. <laughs> Blue Blood is nutty. Out of ammo. Okay, reinforcements are still coming. Oh, yes, he can actually get out. Not only is he a beast at shooting, but he's also super mobile. I thought we'd have to escort him another turn. Um, fortunately, it means we've got these new guys who are moving before, though. So, yeah, damn, these guys should have actually uh, just escaped. I didn't think Blue Blood would be able to run that coming. far. Gives damn, room we could have escaped. Oh, well. Oh well. Oh, Verge! And this is on fire. Um, we gotta run. We gotta run. Jeez, they are. Don't do it. Don't do it. I said. I said, don't do it. I said, don't do it. All right. All right. Uh, let's stabilize this dude. Oh. <laughs> I said, don't do it! Yeah. Alright, we got it. Jesus. It's weird you can leave your unconscious guys in evac. That's a, that's a definite departure from XCOM 2. Holy shit! I like it though. I like when they do that. Um, I, I'd rather get punished than have it... Oh, you can leave with bleeding guys? Alright. Um, but yeah, I like it when it's, I like it when it's a little rough, so to speak. Um, but yeah, no, it, that was, uh, that was some good shit. I like when it's, I like, I like when it's trickier than when it's too easy. I'd rather have those mid- I enjoy both, actually. Like, I enjoy steamrolling the enemies, but I also enjoy when it gets a little tricky. Um, alright. Too gravely wounded, though. That's troublesome. We'll see what wounds they get. Um, rounds complete, number of encounters, enemies killed 12, enemies captured 8. 8 is actually really good, we got a few captures there from the reinforcements. That's so annoying, that was unnecessary. He would have already been critically wounded, so it doesn't matter, but that's annoying. I didn't know Blue Blood could move quite that far. Easy going operation, right? Right? We're doing it. Alright, two days towards active assembly project, which uh, instantly finishes it. Uh, minus two unrest, uh, we got the Illyrium from evidence, and we got the intel from captured enemies. The name, uh, oh, is that what it was? No, what was the name? What was the name? Uh, I'm not seeing the... <laughs> Easy going was the operation name, okay. Uh, is that real? If so, that's my, potentially my episode name is, uh, Operation Easy Going. Alright. Uh, due to its ge- it might be, it might be the name anyway. Uh, that's a good name. Uh, due to its geography, Angler's Point was the best part of the city in the occupation days. When food was short, you could catch your dinner. It felt open despite that ugly city wall in the background. Plus, the advent patrols weren't as high strung because it was too central for the resistance to hit. Stay out of Bugtown, a local guide to uh, City 31. So yeah, we got the assembly. Uh, 
Axion has completed training, unlock potential. It would be nice to have the tank back uh, since we ruined everyone out. And we got improved field streams finally, and next is armor. Okay. Uh, I know you don't talk about the invasion, but what about after? Were you some kind of interrogator? Not at first. I was assigned to a scientist with broad popular appeal. What'd you do? I ensured he spoke of our arrival in a positive light, emphasized the benefits of bowing down to the elders. That's kind of gross. If we failed, plan B was to purge the planet of all sentient life. Purge? You're a gross hero. <laughs> okay. Not from that, less wrong is still wrong. I accept that now. All right, I don't. There's a lot of this dialogue I find like just bad and cringy and shit like that. But that that was pretty funny. You're a gross hero, and Verge is just my favorite overall. Like Ver Verge is the only one with like a personality so far of the ones I've had um, that talks a lot at least. Um, maybe some of the other ones have them. Uh, anyway, but you know, I like Verge, and he's actually seems distinct and stuff. Uh, let's see, essential personnel was completed, lowered, yeah, whatever. Things are getting rough, though. Uh, training complete, mobility and armor by one, that's super nice. Uh, agents idle, that's fine. Assembly complete, improved field teams. We're going enhanced armor next, uh, we'll check that in a sec. Scavenger market is open as well. Miss shot deal two damage to the target. Wow, we have a lot of intel. Targeting system shot supply hollow targeting to the target, which grant allies a plus fifteen aim bonus against that target. Uh, that's that's decent. That's really decent for breach too. We can put that on whoever is most likely to breach first if we want. We'll come back to this. I'm not sure if we need any of this. Uh, we do have a lot of intel now, actually, though. Let's check here. See what we're gonna do. Um, We can get intel. This is this still going up? Let me check that. The magic of the internet. Oh, that's the oh Operation Easy Going Pyre. Okay. <laughs> Very nice. Very nice. All right. Yeah, this doesn't seem to be going up anymore. It was for a while. Ah. Hmm. Whatever. My, my computer is being weird is what it is. Ah, all right, um, let's see. We could go for more money. We've got a ton of intel now. Uh, what I wanted to check was district missions. Does that work on, on this as well? Um, yeah, we could get intel. We could get credits as well. We could Install two teams. No, it's probably too expensive. I'm just trying to figure out what we want to do here uh, Team wise because yeah, that determines what Intel we how much Intel we use and stuff uh, Let's go ahead. We do want the enhanced armor. That's for sure. So let's use some of our Illyrian there uh, Let's check our scars the fun part uh, Hot Hobbled is one of the really bad ones, so Terminal is Operation Easy Going Pyre, yep. Uh, holy shit. Hobbled. Mobility 7. She's probably gonna have to sit out. Uh, let's see what, whoops, uh, let's see what else we got. Unfocused. Psy Offense reduced by 30. That is also really bad. Not quite as debilitating, since he's got super high chance to hit generally, but that's pretty bad too. It's pretty bad. Not quite as bad as Hobbled, but pretty bad. Ugh! So we're gonna put one into training. Uh, who does that leave? Uh, I 
think we take her out. Oh, Ax that's right. Axiom is back in. Uh, so that's decent. Let's go ahead. Train terminal with fitness hobbled. We want basic conditioning. She might be out for a while because we want to give her health so that doesn't happen again too. I've kind of been shuffling agents around. Uh, but she hasn't got even her basic stuff yet. But yeah, let's start with fitness, because hobbled is pretty damn bad. Uh, let's put her in for fitness. Yeah, don't look so smug. She's like, yeah, 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 I got blowed up. Uh, you watched the Zywins video? X-Wins or whatever. One guy, one guy got scars in two missions in a row. Both HP reduced. He ended with two HP? I think that's sort of what happened to... Uh, Axiom, but not thankfully not with the HP. Axiom, I think, is still sitting on two. Let's see, armory. I believe he's still sitting on two. Yeah, this is reduced will by four by fifteen, and he currently has reduced by thirty. So yeah, he's got uh, shell shock stack twice. I'm not sure if they were consecutive missions, but pretty close, I think, pretty close missions uh, to each other. Um, Armory, let's see, training. We'll have spec ops. We so yeah, uh We might even take her for a bit. Uh, I don't know. Scavenger, yeah, I know. I'm still gonna do that. Um shot stock is nice, but I'm not sure who we put it on. Um could put it on Verge. Oh, I wish I wish this took you to loadout or something, but it is what it is. Uh loadout. Oh, he's got laser sight. Oh, we actually. Oh, we're gonna want that on our shotgun now that we have it back, though. Maybe we buy another set of trank rounds. I don't really want to, but it could be nice to have tranks on a shotgun, save for epic guns. So you don't think I should get any of that at all? Just save for epic guns. Do epic guns just randomly show up here? Is that where they show up? Targeting system. Yeah. All right. Um, we have tons of intel, but no, we can we can just sit on it for now. I don't need the scope, and sometimes it rewards for missions. Ah, very cool. Uh, advanced stock or hollow targeting is tempting. Uh, hollow targeting, like I said, would be really nice for breach if we know who's going in first. Targeting the blue blood is good. Yeah, that's, I was thinking that. Stock is all right. You can target two enemies. True. Or hit the same one twice and get get aim on yourself. Um, but yeah, maybe targeting system. I think we pass on stock for now. It's nice, but not required. Yeah, let's grab targeting system. All right, down to oh, I, we had a ton of intel, but that eats through it. It felt like we had a ton of intel. Now we don't. Uh, is what it is. All right, assembly is going. Don't get for the second shot. Oh. Maybe. We'll see. Um, and let's see. I think we do go for intel here then too. We're a little low on credits, but we'll have time to make that up. Uh, we could get bonus credits here, but that's not really what I want. Um, and it's not Friday yet, so we don't care about uh, placing more field teams. Field teams currently cost 65 or 80, and I think I would want more intel even though we already have a few of those so maybe that's too much stacking maybe we go for another finance for credit i don't know but yeah we have one more we have enough intel for one more field team to place and this this is working for now we will have snack uh done soon but yeah let's grab more intel i think intel is pretty good uh and yeah that that is Unquarantined now and going back up. We will be able to drop it down again soon. Uh, so yeah, this is we're, we're juggling. We're juggling. Uh, let's go ahead and support a raid. Get some intel. Intel. When are we? Okay, so we got the spec ops completed, which gave us credits. We did grab credits this time. Uh, when are we going to get another unit? I want another unit. We have seven, no, six right now, because we're not counting that guy. Uh, we can do another spec ops. Do we want to, though? I guess. 
I guess, and grab more intel. Oh, we might need more lyrium as well at some point. Lyrium is only 20 though, it's not super. Let's grab more intel. Intel is always good. I want to use her at some point, but at this point she's under leveled too. Um, let's see. I think we hit this with the reduction. And let's see what we've got. This is intel. We'll pass on this though probably since we're only getting the one reduction since it's only at one. Oh wow, there's actually two. Okay, interesting. Um, didn't see that other one. This one gives us a hollow scanner breach item and two unrest. We could just let that one go up too. This gives us a little bit of credit and two days towards reveal. Would let us manage... Uh, Good idea to rotate soldiers at the start? Yeah, probably. Maybe we should bring snack. Maybe instead of... Verge is so good, though. So you can send the veterans to training late. That's a good point. And he's going to need to be out at some point anyway. Training in one day. So she'll be back. Maybe we'll take Blue Blood and Verge out. No, maybe we'll leave her out. I want her back for when we take the snake, though, if we do take the snake. Um, just for heals and stuff, for support. But we could also just swap uh, Verge and uh, Snack Torque, since Verge is much less useful than he was, I assume. I don't know how much it plays in. Let's see. He's currently at 44 Psy, and he lost 30. So yeah, he lost almost half. Um, psy offense, I'm assuming that's the same as Psy offense, yeah. Um, so yeah, he is less useful. We could take Snack right now, and I think we wanted basic conditioning after that. So yeah, basically she would still be training for three days. So yeah, maybe we do take Snake right now. Maybe we put... Verge in since he's less useful. Other thing we could do is blue blood, but I'm actually blue blood is really top training takes five days. Damn. But yeah, blue blood I'm really warming up to. Uh, yeah, let's put let's put him in for three days on what was it? Leg work still, right? Yeah, I think we were getting more intel, right? Intel is pretty good. Yeah. So yeah, let's get him on leg work and. We're bringing the snack for the first time. Yeah, so he'll be out three days. She'll be out three days because I think we put her immediately back in for two days. I think that's what we're doing. Um, and this gives us hollow scanner breach item. This doesn't give us great rewards, but does bring the uh, time down on this, which lets us uh, hit less. Let's see, we do want to hit this to help manage. Oh shoot, maybe we should have leveled this. That's what we could have done. That's what we should have done. We should have leveled this and it would have given us one more off the... Ugh! Oh, I was thinking about leveling things, but it didn't occur to me that I should play around the uh, anarchy like that. Because I know we can play around the intel per thing, but I forgot it, this also is based on field level. Shoot! That would have been the play. That would have been the play. We upgrade this, which gives us 5 bonus intel income and 20 intel when we do this mission. As well as one more one more unrest off. Yep, that, that was a misplay. If I could do it again, I would spend the intel right now on that. Unfortunate. Uh, but yeah question is do we do this I don't really like speeding this up I like taking my time so we can get more rewards and stuff but the problem of course is uh, that this is going to overflow into city anarchy we will eventually be able to deal with that but I mean it's pretty expensive we still need one two three four field teams I think I do still ignore it and this is security we could get oh we could get more intel here as well so yeah we could get more intel here question is do i want to do that or 
spread them around. Do I want to upgrade, which costs 80, or place more, which costs also 80 if I wanted that? Uh, that lets us get the anarchy down. We're not in a big trouble. Wait, that's not Illyrium. There we go. That's so weird. Uh, one out of 14. Completing an investigation removes three points. I'm not sure if that's an investigation or they mean the entire thing. Um, I think we're fine to let it play up a little bit. I'm not sure though. Um, but yeah, maybe we should look towards getting field teams in every place so we can start doing that. Let's see, did we get... Oh, we do have access to expert field teams uh, right now when we can, but I want the armor first. Alright, um, yeah, a lot of decisions here. I think I ignore this. The re like I said, the rewards are never great either. I think we just push for here. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. And I don't think we upgrade. I think we do want to spread it around so we can get this as fast as possible. I think that's the play. So yeah, I think we do cutting edge here. Same we pass up on the intel, but I want to keep this from going to max. It's just more efficient, especially since this gives minus two. So yeah, we actually bring this down to net next to nothing. Well, actually nothing, not next to nothing, nothing at nothing. Uh, and yeah, that'll go up to four. That's fine. Anyway, let's go ahead get set up for the next mission And we will still do that tonight. Let's see. What is our uptime out of curiosity? Almost four hours Good 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 good. Yeah, it's been it's been a good one. I've been enjoying it Cutting edge 31 PD received a tip about an Illyrian powered device used in a string of recent burglaries We should seize it before it slips away and we get a hollow scanner which I think is just like Patchwork's ability, but not bad having another one. I'm not sure we have space for it, but I guess we could always give it to our android or something. Alright, so yeah, not amazing rewards, but it does let us manage the unrest, which is always good. Alright, let's go ahead. Oh yeah, he's got armor now. Let's go ahead and make items available. I think we give him back the hair trigger maybe let's give you who has the oh eat patchwork does have the ability to fire twice it's better on axiom let's give axiom mock weave reflex grip we'll give him magazine that's not a huge deal and we'll give you back the trank rounds And sure, auto key card. And we. Ooh, crit chance at close range versus hair trigger. Sure, let's do crit chance at close range. So yeah, he's set up. Blue blood can have the hair trigger since he can fire twice. We also have expanded magazine and. Oh, yeah, let's give him targeting. Perfect. Breaching charge. Sure, whatever. Plasma grenade, sure, whatever. Um, oh shoot, we're missing. We don't. Uh, we verge is out for now, so we're actually only have one of the enhanced weapons, but that's fine. And we do have a keypad door here. Oh wow. Uh, huh. That might be our only option. Okay, so we still have two things. Uh, it's probably going to be on patchwork. Get the med kit from the android. I'm not sure we have room. We'll see. Um, but you're right. It won't play any effect. Uh, I guess we give expanded magazine to her. It's not great, but everyone else has what they need. We could also give it to Torque, but her gu this gun is better. Uh, yeah, let's go. Let's go superior expand. Wait. I thought I gave the targeting system. Do do we have two targeting systems? When did that happen? That's unfortunate. Um, but whatever. Whatever. All right, that's fine. I'm not sure how that happened. Oh, you're right. We do have a spot for 
more stuff. All right. No additional items, no additional items, no additional items. Med kit. Oh, or do we actually want the frag grenade? Oh yeah, we don't have a healer, so let's bring another med kit. She's squishy. Let's not put it on her, because she could get knocked out. Um, okay, let's give it to Blue Blood, who's a little tankier. Uh, give you the plasma grenade, you the med kit. Yeah, because if she gets knocked out, we lose access to that entirely. Um, we are leaving a frag grenade on the table, unfortunately, but it is what it is. I want the trank rounds. So yeah, we'll give the... Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm not going to put that on there because uh, we only have one encounter. Alright, that looks pretty good. At least we still have patchwork. Patchwork's back in business. Um... Man, Torque is better, or sorry, Axiom is better than ever with armor point and more mobility. Blue Blood has the targeting system. Anyway, uh, we'll call it here and then be back with the main mission. Thanks for watching.